and girls. Today we're going to do something called subitizing. Subitize is a word that was coined by a man named E.L. Kaufman in the year 1949. It comes from the Latin adjective, which means sudden. What we're going to do is we're going to look at some cards that have some stars on them. And we're going to see how quickly we can name the number that we see on there. So maybe we'll see five stars. But the cards are going to come really quickly and go by really quickly. So we have to be able to say it fast. And if you're doing this in your classroom, you have to do it quietly. So whisper. So if you see two stars, say two. And then the next card will come up and you might see five and say five. And for parents and teachers, what's neat about this it's a foundation of building number. If we can identify rapidly, accurately, and confidently the number we recognize on these cards of items, this particular tutorial has stars, then our ability to put into long-term memory our concept of number is, um, is good. We like that. So, have at it, have fun, remember, whisper. Okay, enjoy. Subitizing. If we're fast and we're correct and we're certain, we're going to be super smart at math. Subitizing. It looks like subitizing, but it's really subitizing. You're going to tell me how many stars do you see without counting? Whisper. Subitizing. I bet you were rapid. You were accurate and confident, so you're super smart at math. Look at those huge words. This was our first subitizing. I'm going to give you two more. I like to practice this at home and in small groups at school with my friends. I make my own dot cards, and then what I try to do is to try to trick my friends and family, and I try to go faster and faster. Mm -hmm. 